All right. This is it. This is it. Mask or no mask. This is the big controversy. We've been going through this. We're going through it more every day. We got people losing their lives over this argument. Mask or no mask. Think about it close. Think about it deep. We're in the middle of a pandemic. Mask or no mask. Do you have a right to control your body? To not wear a mask. To be able to move freely as you want to. Regardless of what's going on around you. Or do you have to do what the CDC and the mayor and the governor tell you and wear a mask, stay in the house and shut your mouth. Mask or no mask. Let's take take a look at these pictures. Now, remember, the president, he didn't wear a mask. Now, that surge is back going and nobody can find a cure. So he didn't put a mask on now. So mask or no mask. Well, we got some problems in Michigan. The governor said the surge is back on. COVID is getting rev revving back up. People are getting sick. I want everybody to wear a mask. Uh, that by the law. I just made up a brand new law. Wear a mask. Oh, I need five hundred dollars. I need to give you a five hundred dollar ticket. So ever since this governor has been giving orders during this pandemic, we had this group of people that's been rebelling against her. So ma mainly it's, these, it's conservatives and so-called law abiding people. Now we got. These law-abiding people, otherwise known as the sheriff of Macomb County, that says he's not going to give anybody a ticket. He don't care what the governor says. He, not go he said she don't have the right to make up a law. Now, I don't have a, a law book or a degree. But if it's a pandemic and somebody say wear a mask, I'll wear one. I'm not going to trust the damn sheriff because he don't know nothing about pandemics. All he know is to shoot somebody, shoot a black guy. That's all he know. Now we got a bunch of sheriffs and police. They want to be American heroes talking about they're not going to bother anybody over a mask. Well, you was bothering me before the corona at that sheriff sale when you was selling my house. Now, some people say they can't wear a mask. The man is in the picture above. He says he has PTSD from Afghanistan. He's been through so much that he can't wear a mask. And he's afraid to go outside because he'll take a mask off, go outside, and somebody might beat him up. And he could die easily from his injuries from the war. Now, Michigan is full of weird people and sickos. So yesterday at the party store, two guys got into a big argument in the fight because the old guy told the young guy to put on a damn mask. Stop breathing on me. So the fight led to the young guy stabbing the old guy. And remember, we just arguing about a mask. But when you don't put on that mask, people say you disrespecting them. You trying to get them sick. You risking my life. Okay, this is how it went down. The police caught up to the guy to stab the old man. This is what happened. Yeah, that's the party store they were at. We got into an argument with the old man about wearing a mask. The guy ran away and the sheriff caught up with him. You got to look at him. He's going to knife her. Now, that was a female deputy. She had, to, she had to take that guy down. 
you trying to fight with two or three knives because he because he refused to wear a mask for for his safety and the safety of the people around him. So please, please take care of yourself out there. We got uh, uh, laws. Nobody want to follow the law. They don't want to wear a mask. They don't want to do this. They don't want to do that. We got people falling out dead on the floor. Sick. People yelling, this is my right as American not to wear a mask. And you want to go out and fight and shoot and kill somebody over a damn mask. I don't know when this pandemic going to be over. Because it's still going and going like Energizer batteries. So, so if you haven't caught it, you're going to catch it if you don't wear that mask. So everybody, uh, it's, it's up to you, mask or no mask. You don't wear the mask. Now people want to fight you. The police want to give you a ticket. Some police say they're not going to give you a ticket. Then they, They're going to tell you you're doing a great job. You're an American. It's, it's a crazy place out there. This place is backwards. Backwards news. Out.